told me every time I came to Dallas, I thought, uh, I thought this was a big mistake I made. Uh, the, uh, everything that I thought about uh, theater uh, seemed to all merge into one big, big question. What'd you do it for? <laughs> so I, I, uh, I would always drive up from from Baylor, from Waco, uh, and uh, I, before I went on to the theater, I stopped at the Lucas B and B restaurant and had a cup of coffee and cried a little bit <laughs> and it really was it really was terrible because I was used to being successful and I was not being successful in Dallas and you know, I started. Well I had a wonderful board. The board was made up mostly, thank goodness, of, of Christian science people. And they, they, they were very loyal to the Christian science religion. And uh, they thought, we published a book, he would let you see, if you haven't already seen it, called, If the Idea is Right, It Will Grow. And they kept saying that, and they elected a wonderful man, president of the, of the board, named uh, Sticker, Robert Sticker Sr., and he, uh, he used to call me every Sunday afternoon. He'd call me and assure me every, everything would be going right, call me at home in Waco. And, uh, and eventually it did go right. Well, I uh, I got on the right, started on the wrong foot, you know. I was offered by John Rosenfield, who had taken me all the way to Taliesin East, and he and his wife and introduced me to to Frank Lloyd Wright and his whole family really and truly very nice to me. So he said to me, uh, he wanted to give me $50 a month as long as I would give him first choice of whatever I was doing. <laughs> and I thought that was very dishonest and not, not at all like my personality at all. And so I said, no. This made him very angry. <laughs> he never got over it. I didn't either. Yeah, I knew it, yeah, pretty well. Well, she had the guts to start a theater and uh, to uh, pay actors and uh, I think she started a whole new form of theater uh, called the Dinner Theater. And uh, I, uh, she was a student when I met her uh, from uh, North Texas to Teachers College. An enormous energy. Yeah. I just thought if, that uh, she had a had the nerve and the strength to uh, to produce uh, a, a professional theater uh, in a little place like like the theater, theater she took over from from the, the state uh, fair. Huh? It was for the state fair. Yeah. Well, you also talked about how supportive she was of yeah, the idea. Yeah, she was very much, very for, very much for a theater being built in Dallas. 
that would be a theater. And now, not had a made-over place actually had to work in.